Islam is real, the Israelite school of universal and practical knowledge under commanding General Yohanna presents the Lord's 55th annual Passover. That's right, the Lord's 55th annual Passover is rapidly approaching. Commanding General Yohanna is calling for all blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans to remember what the Lord did for us by saving us from our oppressors and choosing us to be a special people unto him. The real Jews and Israelites. Passover will be held in Durham, North Carolina. Pay your Passover fee. Anyone 17 years of age or older must pay $200. Come and enjoy fresh lamb, unleavened bread, and the spirit of Christ. Can't wait to see you all there, Israel. Shalom. Cabins on streets and corners, all is feeling righteous. Real particular, nobody else dared to compare to. Train for war, men of war, and war like apparel. Prefer our leaders can't get between us. Watch the next one, Yo, from birth, <laughs> I like, feel like what you mean? experienced racism twice. The Brother, that's in one of my stand up jokes. That's one of my stand up jokes. Like, <laughs> like <laughs> people want to talk about no, racism. Like I've experienced like racism well. from white and black people. And when I tell black people that are black people, but they're like, how? How can black people? I'm like, mm. look at me. Yes, how long man. did it take for you to get used to me? How many questions did you have? Mm. How many underhanded jokes did you have? <laughs> Triggered. You know, like that. How, how many Triggered. backhanded things did you say to your brethren? <laughs> Triggered. Yeah, jolting, jolting. Like, yeah, boom. Yo, yo, fam, it's the same it's racism. You know what I'm saying? And only I would know that because I only look how I look. Mm. But I just don't. No, I don't watch but I, it's, it's not that serious. I accept it and let it go. It's just a thing of I have to let it flow in terms of because I'm nothing you've seen. Yeah, it's like an alien. It's not that bad, mate. I know what I'm saying, but you're treating it like that. Let's not start you're treating it like that. So hold on, Please. this brother's what? What's the brother name, dog? About Ginger, something like that. G Ginger J. <laughs> Ginger J. And he claims that he's been through racism twice because he goes to racism with black people and with white people. <laughs> Get me? I, I, don't, I don't know about this one because I've been with racism with black people too. It does something we as black people we criticize each other sometimes. So luck here. And this goes. This goes to show. He said that. He said that he goes to racism with black people and white people. So. While we're arguing, saying, yo, you're too white, man, you're too light skinned, you're too ready, ginger, the white man still don't consider him black. If you like to go for racism with us, like, so, instance, if we don't accept you because we think you're white, then you think, well, the white man accepts him then. Even the white man don't. So if you're a black man out there and you're light skinned or you got straight features, listen, man, you'll be fooling yourself, man. There's Cubans out there who are very pale skinned and the white man don't accept them either. Still oppress them in Cuba, man. Right. His brother goes, he went through hard times with black people and white people. Listen, man, I don't want to say, Listen, I'm dark skinned and shit. Dougal, but I, I had my fair time. I've had some some comments from black people myself, man. I've been called, you know, you, you know, you're black this and you're black that, man. I don't have to say it. it's a thing like this. It's a Dougal, what would you call it? It's a, it's a civil thing amongst black people, man. Sometimes you know we miss each other's complexion. So it's one of them ones, but it's not hatred. And I wouldn't call it racism, man. Will, what he's talking about is being around black people, and you're the darkest one. And a man might say, "Yo, man, you're kind of you're kind of dark," you know. Or shut up, man, you black bastard. Or so, something like that between amongst us. But, but we still live in the ghetto together. We still love each other. He's not about little comments. Racism is not getting a job because you're light-skinned. Racism is police dogs being set on you because you're light-skinned. Right. Racism is you can't come to the school because you're light-skinned. He said he experienced racism from black people and white people. You have not experienced racism felt by black people. You've experienced racism only by white people, man. What you're talking about is a bit of, you know... It's a bit of a brother's thinking, hmm, you're, you're, you're different from the rest of us. Might even be an insult, might not be nice, but it is not racism, man. At all, man. Racism, black people can't be racist, man. We can't be racist. We don't own no jobs to not give you a job. Racism, how could we can't, racism is when we refuse you a job, man. What you're going through, what the sister said, it's a bit of colorism, man. And some people are ignorant, some black people are ignorant, and they, they don't know that black people come in all shades. This brother ain't mixed, by the way. He's not mixed at all. You know, and, and also, white people go for it too, man. Do you know ginger white people get laughed at by regular white people? Do you know white people with a Scottish accent get dissed done by a man with a British accent? It happens amongst all races, man. Pakistanis laugh at dark-skinned Pakistanis. It happens amongst all of that. It's not racism, man. It's not nice. 
It may hurt your feelings, but that's not racism, man. We're all together, man. It's, I guarantee you using the Mark Duggan rights along with us, man. Please pull you over the same way they pull us over. That, that erase them. <coughs> a bit, a bit, I mean, what, what, what's the word? It's insulting. And, you know, we might laugh at you. I call you ginger this and you know, ginger spice, whatever the case may be. But that ain't racism, man. But the police YouTube is racism. You know what I mean? Stop and frisking you because you're, you, you're black. Not because you're ginger, not because you're light-skinned, because you're one of us, man. That's racism. That's what you need to be focused on. It's not a thing like got racism from both sides. You never experience racism by both sides, man. Only by white people, man. I guarantee. With that, I yield. Yeah, well, well, I think, I think, I think what... When when he says racism, I think he just means that niggas is clowning him because he's ginger. That's all it is. Like, mm. remember, if everybody else has got black hair and you got ginger hair, pe people's going to ask. So I wouldn't say it's racism. Like, he's making out like he can't roll with these like, because I'm ginger. Nah, it don't, it don't work like that. While it is, black people clown black people about everything. Now, yeah. if, 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 if tall people clown short people, short people call tall people lanky and all of those kind of things. <laughs> so, it's nothing to do with racism. It's just to do with obviously all these people have black hair and you have ginger hair. So they're gonna all their jokes is gonna be ginger jokes. It's like growing up, people made jokes out of out of everything, man. And it had nothing to do with racism. Because at the end of the day, we we know that you're still a nigger, man. We know that you're still the same as us. All you got is ginger hair, that's it. We even make jokes about French speaking Benjamites, man. It's just how it's exactly. How it is, like. <laughs> exactly. Remember, That's remember, cool. remember, Rocky Ali told me there was there was rasters, there's there's French rasters. I, I I was, it took me three the three four days to understand. You see, like how he said, I'm nothing like you've seen. That's nothing like I've heard. When I heard, um, <laughs> <laughs> remember, Rocky Ali broke it down to me that there's French rasters. I was like, damn. It took me three <laughs> four days to understand it. I'm still coming to terms with it. <laughs> I didn't think them. I didn't think they extended past damn Jamaica, so lucky. I thought they didn't make it out of St. Thomas. I thought they was only found in St. Thomas, and that's it. So, so, so yeah, what this brother means here is the clown in him because he's ginger. Whereas, he goes that his, I think he said him and two of his other brothers are ginger. But the thing is, he's still a brother, man. We know he's still right. a brother. They know he's still a brother. He's just ginger. I don't know why. I don't know how, but he's just ginger, man. And... <laughs> There's nothing wrong with it. The, the ginger it suits him, man. It suits him, man. Yeah, yeah. I mean, but the spray is right, though. The, the, don't you think he's kind of pushing it? Spray's like, it's not that bad. This is yeah, ginger but... Oh, man. Something to like your, something to like your, your albino or something else. Something. <laughs> right. Oh, calm down. Ain't the worst case. We've seen ginger niggas before. Hmm? Oh, Salaki, out of one. This nigga really, he weak. He got a weak spirit. He can't take a joke. You know, he probably got bullied. Because, you know, that's, that's it. That nigga really weak. That's it. You understand? Whether you're light skin, I'll make fun of a brown skin nigga right now. <laughs> it, 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 it don't matter. We, again, especially in high school, we crack jokes about anything. You understand? It, it really don't matter. So I'll, I'll crack jokes at any nigga with a crooked with crooked teeth and shit like that. Well, I'm, I'm racist now. Nah, this nigga's right. soft. This nigga's soft. That's it. Uh, uh, this us. Like, well, it's, it could. The thing is. Listen, man, your, your hair's ginger. It's not bad. You got niggas like Cisco that dyed his. What color did Cisco dye his again? Silver. Oh, this nigga look like a sun. Golden. This is what I'm saying. See, I'll clown Cisco. And Cisco's still a nigga, man. I'll, I'll clown yeah. shit out of him. <laughs> Cisco dyed his hair silver, man. <laughs> and I'll clown him for it, man. It's nothing to do with racism. It's just weird. But obviously, this brother was born with ginger hair. Obviously, he's probably had it his whole life. So it's, you, you, you see what it is? Sometimes people can joke, and then you know when people keep doing the same joke over time, it starts to piss you off. Right. I, I think that's where he's at with it. He's like, yo, because under under thing he said he's thirty three years old, so he's been receiving ginger jokes from the age of a kid, because nobody can't understand why he's black with ginger hair. It's, it's a lucky out of one. The ahead. thing is that it's never gonna stop. Uh? We're cracking jokes at, at, at this nigga even even while he's in the casket. <laughs> That, listen, that and really that that's our, that's just us, really. Again, some brothers could be ignorant, right? Or you're not black enough, this and that. A lot of brothers will just listen. We'll we'll roast you for anything. We'll we'll just crack a joke for anything, you know. That that that's that's really what it is. If you can't take a joke, Lord be with you. Listen, Benjamite will give you nicknames. Just listen, fucking the, the man on the blog. We call him Fat Larry. Why? Because the man's fat. If you, if, that that's it. The 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 um the is is a correct. Listen, is a correct. Call it flaquito, meaning you're skinny. Why? Because you're skinny. 
they give, they give you nicknames that for for weak for weak brothers for sisters, listen, it's gonna hurt their soul to be like, you know what, that's racist. Nigga, Canelo, Canelo the boxer, his name be, is it, it means cinnamon because he's a gingerhead. That's not racism. You know, you've never been discriminated against because oh, you're a ginger. We, you know, from white people, of course, yeah, that's racism. You know, but from from brothers. You're just weak. That's it. You're just weak. That's so it. Like it. It boils down to this, man. This brother Ginger is still a brother, man. That's right. When the Bible goes, the Bible goes, what? My heritage is a speckled bird. I mean, what? Israel comes in all shades of brown, man. Brother, I don't care if you're Ginger, man. You're still my brother, man. That's that's the fact of the matter. We're coming, just like how just like how you got um, Chris, man. You got different flavors, but they're all Chris, man. And likewise, we're black. And we come in all different flavors, man. We got ginger brothers, light skin brothers, we're all one, man. You get me? And fair enough, the brother might look a bit different, so brothers might look at him weird, but let me tell you something, that isn't racism, man. What are you going for ain't racism? Let me tell you something, black, I guarantee he was accepted in the black community. Because black people, we accept our brother. We accept anybody, man, no matter what shade you like. Ain't no one more right. loving than black people, man. We, accept, we even accept people are heathens, man. We even accept Asians in our crew and everything. <laughs> guarantee listen you go to a white neighborhood being pale and ginger listen you won't fit in man trust me they'll let you know that you're not one of us man what you experience ain't racism police killing mark Duggan, that's racism man right. the soft laws in england that's racism man please kicking off your door talking about we smell weed that's racism man not giving you a job because you're black that's racism the windrush generation being deported that's racism what you're going through with black people it's not right it's not right but it's nowhere near racism man a bit of name calling the bible goes terrible man the bible goes you shouldn't you know Roaster brother, man. That's in the Bible. Talking about um what's the scripture longer bar about the roasting about um a sport? Uh, I know, I think it's in Proverbs somewhere. Something is this not is it not a sport? So, someone does something and says, Is it not sport? Something yeah, like that. Man. I can't remember it. If someone does something to you, you got uh, uh, throw daggers at you and say, Is this not a sport? I mean someone would, would dish you and make it like yo, I'm just playing. The Bible's against that man, and it's wrong to diss a brother because how he looks, man. You know what I mean? So it's, it's rough, but brother just know that what you went through is not racism, man. Right. You get me? You're one of us nonetheless, man. And if you think what we're putting you through is racism, listen, man, the metro, uh, metropolitan police, man, you better ask Mark Duggan about racism. Mark Duggan was what, what you call mixed race, man. And they didn't care. Listen, in the black community, if you're mixed, you're black. In the white community, you're mixed. You, you, you're still not one of them. And you end up like Mark Duggan, man. That's racism. Damn, the white one, don't, you don't like if you got a, a shade of black in you, man. You're a ginger. Ginger, man. The, the black man, the white man is still telling you not one of his. You know what I mean? So that's what it is, man. What are you going through? Hey, racism.